Hey, what is up everybody? It is AJ here and in today's video, I wanna go through a feature that I came across in OneNote today that people have been asking for for years and I was using OneNote and I was like, wait, what's this new pen out there? And it is the ability to automatically convert your handwriting to text as you're writing. So this video is uh, made very quickly and messily, but I just wanted to get the feature out there for those of you that are looking for it. Uh, just so you know, I'm running Windows 11 on my device and I'm using the regular OneNote, not the OneNote for Windows 10 app. Uh, this is just the regular OneNote application. Uh, and I'll link the version of, um, of OneNote I have down below, just so you know what version number I have, because I don't know if this is rolled out to all the versions right now. Uh, but anyway, let's jump on the computer and let me show you exactly how you can use the automatic ink to text conversion as you're writing, because it is really, really cool. So I'm here in OneNote and you can see in the draw tab, I have my regular eraser. And then I've got a pen with an A next to it and all my other colors. What we're gonna look at now is this pen with an A because if I hover over it, let's actually see if it gives it a name. It actually says text pen. Use this pen to automatically convert your handwriting to text. So it's that little description down there. I'll zoom in as you make the video, um, but I'll show you exactly how this works now. I'm gonna go full screen. Uh, and it actually tells you here, handwriting with a pen, the text can only be used with a pen. Switch to a different drawing tool to use this feature. That's okay, I'm gonna go got it. And you'll see that as I write, you see that it's actually converting that text over where the cursor is. The cursor was in the heading here, so it started popping it in straight away. Uh, what I've noticed is that if you get something wrong, you might say, oh, well, what am I gonna do if I need to go back and actually change it? You know, just put a line through it. And it actually highlights that section where I can quickly just go cut, and it puts my cursor right there. And then I can write high, and it will just throw it back there. So if you make mistakes, which was my biggest concern of what if you make a mistake, you can actually just put a line through whatever you wanted to make a, uh, you know, correct. Cut that word, your cursor is already there. And then you can just write in whatever you wanted to put and it's gonna throw it straight there. I'm gonna select on the page now. It's gonna bring us to, you know, writing the page. I'm gonna start writing anywhere, let's go over here. and even the animation of it flying across the page to where your cursor is. I love that because I can write anywhere on the page. Let's actually go over here now. And you'll see that it's gonna go straight to it. Uh, I'll use the pen to double tap, it doesn't do anything. Uh, actually, it inserts that. I'm not gonna do that though. I'm just gonna cross it out one more time. I'm gonna cut. and it's just gonna drop the word back in there. I found today that it was very, very accurate, but of course when I did make mistakes, all I had to do was cross out that word. It's going to basically highlight it, hit cut. Now my cursor's already there. I'm gonna type, I'm gonna start writing anywhere. And it's just gonna drop it straight to where my cursor was. This to me is a really great integration of the tool. Uh, you know, with OneNote, you can just basically tap anywhere to start writing. And now of course, once you've tapped there, you can just start drawing and writing away. And your handwriting is just gonna convert straight to text. And there you have it. That is how you can now convert your handwriting into text automatically with OneNote. My biggest concern about this was what would you do when you make a mistake? And that is really quite easy. Just cross over that word. It's gonna highlight it. Then you hit the cut button because it gives you the option tool and then start writing away and it's gonna replace it. This actually really, in my opinion, this is a really great integration of the tool. Uh, and I think it's a very widely requested feature and I'm so glad that they finally incorporated it into OneNote. Let me know what you guys think of this feature in the comment section down below. Of course, if you did like this video, let me know by giving a thumbs up. And if you want to supercharge the ways your computer, hit that subscribe button as well. Thanks for watching and we'll see you next time. Bye.